hello friends and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello nice to meet you in today's video we are going to just jump right into it i am filming a what's inside my bag so this is my bag um so when it comes to the bags i have i haven't really been too great with bags lately <laughs> So I try to find bags at either a discount price or gently used. It's just easier, I feel like, for me because if the bag breaks, I don't feel too so bad about it. And that is actually what happened to my last bag I was using, which is a Steve Madden bag. And then, of course, this one is a Steve Madden bag. i actually been really liking Steve Madden bags. The last Steve Madden bag I had, it looked kind of like this, but... This part didn't have this hook. It was basically like on the bag and then it ripped up. So the, this thing wasn't working and to hold the strap, you kind of need that part. So yeah, that's basically what happened to the last bag. So when I got this Steve Madden bag, I tried to get it to a similar style as the last bag I had, but I couldn't find that bag. And I got that bag at Ross. So I could have went back to Ross, but at Ross the bag is like $43, $45 and I was on Poshmark and somebody was selling a bag for like, I want to say like 10, I think they were selling it for 10. So I guess they were really trying to get rid of it. But of course, you know, with shipping on Poshmark, it's like what, like eight bucks. <laughs> so really I paid like 20, but yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't mad at all. Cause it was in great condition. I'll keep the name. In the description box below so you know the name of the bag because I can't think of it off the top of my head but that being said let's just hop right into the bag because I kind of need to clean it out and that's probably <laughs> what made me like think of doing this video is so I can clean it out so starting with the front there is a front pocket I don't think I keep anything in that front pocket at all no there's nothing in that front pocket um, and that's basically because I have this thing right here and it's a um, pocket holder. So the Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer is in here. And this is also from Bath and Body Works. I think they still have this. It looks like that and it has a charm. And one of my rings fell off. <laughs> but it has a charm. I think they still have it. And And then I have this thing that I keep with me. And this is a lipstick holder I have a chapstick in there I have a Burt's Bees watermelon and I keep that inside this thing I got this off of shop miss a so if they still have it I suggest you get one I absolutely love it and this thing has been in here and it hasn't fell out or anything that is a good thing bag does come with this you could take this off and use it as a head scarf neck scarf it's basically just like one of those thin little scarves I like to keep it on the bag like that you know just how it came so I like that and it does also come with this strap which I do like a long strap to carry my bags because this part right here is heavy <laughs> so next we are going to open it up and it looks like that so there is a pocket right here that has two little pockets and then there's a big pocket and then this is a zipper pocket and then of course there's a, a back pocket so we are going to i guess we can start with the zipper pocket because i already know there's like nothing really in there so let's start with the zipper so we'll unzip the zipper and inside the zipper i keep my planner so i do carry my planner in there and it looks like this this is a kika k ah, a kika k planner looks like that um i'm pretty sure this is the kika k collab with michaels i think i'm pretty sure kika k collab with michaels so yeah you could still possibly find these i guess doing resellers would have them so yeah my planner and then i have a lotion you can zip that back up because that's all i keep um, in there, the hand lotion's actually not supposed to be in there, but <laughs> so there's that. Um, I guess we can go to 
the let's do the back pocket first because the back pocket yeah so inside the back pocket there is a little straw from in and out burger I do have a reusable tote bag. So this is the tote bag where you can make it into like this square pouch and then you just undo it and it's a tote bag and you can fold it back up and it turns into a square pouch. I like that one. I like these ones and I also like the ones they have at World Market. World Market has these little cute ones. I don't really know where my frog is, but it's basically like it has a face of like an animal and then you undo it and of course it's like a reusable bag and you can like fold it back in. And then the next thing I keep in there is a little notebook. And this is from the Happy Planner. So let me take this part off. So it looks like that. It's a little notebook, the one with the girl on it. I think she is so cute. So there's a little notebook. I think Dollar Tree was selling notebooks that look exactly like this. So if you do want a notebook that looks like this and you can't find a Happy Planner or you don't want to spend that much, you could also check out Dollar Tree because I did get a dupe looking one from Dollar Tree that looks exactly like this. And I do have a pen to go with it. I like the Pilot G2 pens. They are my favorite. This is in 07. Um, I like to write in 07, but for my planner, 07 is too big for like the sections I personally feel like. So, so I can get more in a section. I like to use the, I think it's 0 0.38 or 35. One of those, <laughs> I like to use that one in the planner, but it's still by Pilot. I like Pilot pens. These, I, there's, these are like the only pens you will ever see me use. I use them in every color and I have backups. Next thing I have are these and these are disposable paper toilet seat covers. You can get these on Amazon, I think in like a bigger, like a big pack. So they're basically seat covers. So when you use a public restroom, you have your own because a lot of times Public restrooms do not have these. So I highly suggest you get some. I also suggest you get some of these and you bring them with you if you go out of the country. Also, I think a lot of people don't really think about packing these. But I know when I went to London and I would use public restrooms, a lot of public restrooms did not have these. Like at all. Like there was not even a place for them. So I don't know if it's just a different place wise I do that or I, I mean I have no clue but I do highly suggest you keep these in your bag or oh, and for vacation. The thing I keep in there are these wipes. These are the Huggy Simple um, Clean Fragrance Free. They're just wipes so if you need wipes because there's no toilet paper or you need to wipe your kids hands anything like that. I mean these work perfectly. Um, you can get those at Dollar Tree so you, you know you can just throw them in your bag type of things. And the other thing, I did get these at Dollar Tree too. These are the antiseptic, you know, like antiseptic, antibacterial <laughs> um, wipes. Not like this. So this is for, um, to wipe stuff down. So to wipe down tabletops, chairs, anything like that, hands. You can use this. Um, the other thing I keep in there is this, and this is the... A Kirby thing. This came free with the Kirby. What game was that? It was a Kirby game that came out last year. This was like the free, the freebie from Target. So of course I did get one because I bought the game and I put one to the side. <laughs> yeah. Um. So yeah, there's that. And inside I keep all my eye care stuff in here. So here is my glasses cleaner. It's just a Kaiser one. And a cloth for my glasses. And then it's just cloths. A whole bunch of cloths. <laughs> Last things in this pocket, well, in the big part of the pocket, are these juices. I like to keep these in my purse just in case I need any. So these are for when I'm out and about and I want juice because I usually have water with me. I can use one of these. So I do have mango passion fruit is this one and it's crystal light and this one is crystal light and blueberry wait yeah blueberry raspberry so there's that so inside the bag there's also a pocket it's like a zipper pocket 
um, I can try to show you. It's like right there. And then, of course, inside you can see it's just um, Steve Madden everywhere. So inside that zipper pocket, I just keep some Band-Aids and some Neosporin just as a backup. So let's move on to the front pocket up here. So there's a big pocket. And like I said, there's two little section pockets. So we'll do the big pocket. Um, in the big pocket, I have my keys. So um, these are my house keys. So these are my house keys. Oh, and this chain is absolutely adorable. It's Dora. <laughs> Next thing I keep in that pocket, in like, well, inside the pocket, but it fell, is a phone. So it is a phone. It's an iPhone. This is an iPhone, I think, 7. Pretty sure this is 7. So it's just an iPhone 7. It's just a backup. Woo! Almost dropped it. <laughs> it's just a backup phone. <laughs> Um, just in case I need a backup phone when my phone dies or if I want to film video or take picture type of thing or do something like that. I usually use that phone for like businessy stuff. So there's that. And then I have my wallet and it looks like this. It's a um, Michael Kors wallet. It's the one, I think it's called, is it the Jet Center or something? I don't know. It's the one where it has the part where you could put a phone. The only phone that fits in there is this phone, but I don't like to keep it in there. So I basically just keep that part free. Or if I want to put our uh, cash, cash usually goes in that part. If I don't want to put it in like this back section part, I don't know. It's, it's, it's an interesting wallet, but I absolutely love it. And I love the green color. Um, the other thing I keep in here sometimes, this is sometimes in here, is my bank bag. So, yeah, I am a cash stuffer. <laughs> um, so if I have to make a bank deposit or if I'm coming back from the bank, it's like, you know, you need, I feel like you need a bank bag. Because they give you those envelopes. What are you going to fit in those envelopes? Like, for real. There's nothing can fit in those envelopes. So there's that. Um, there's a receipt. From grocery outlet and that's all in that pocket so in one of the little pockets i do have my coin purse um and it looks like this it's a starbucks coin purse and it's like it says san francisco because that's where i am from so this is basically <laughs> this is basically like one of those tourists like items that you get at the Starbucks like from the city that you're in <laughs> but I actually thought it was cute it has dogs on it yep and if you know the street you're a real one so yeah um and in the other pocket I keep a brush and I keep this one it's the mini wet brush I love this brush if you have not used a wet brush, you need to get one. Get a mini one for your purse and then get like a big one, the bigger one for your house. This brush is absolutely amazing. If your kids also don't like to get their hair like combed, combed, or they have like sensitive scalp and like, you know, like stuff like that, this works amazing. It gets off the tangles and they don't, they don't cry. It's like, it's super nice. And I like to use it because of the bob I have now. It, it, it gets a mess. It gets a mess. You guys like this color? I I redyed it. It's the same color as always been actually. I just freshened up the dye. And I I'm actually feeling it. I think I did it good this time. <laughs> so yeah. And I feel like okay, there's like two things in this pocket. I'm like feeling around. Oh, so these were where there went where these dang I can't talk now. So these are where there went. They so these are where now I can't speak English. Oh gosh, I need to go to sleep. <laughs> I was looking for these. Let's make it that way. So these are the NYX Butter Glosses. They look like that. I know they look exactly the same. I don't, I don't know. They look exactly the same, but they're really not. So this is the lighter one I have. And this is in Butterscotch. 
And then the other one is in um, brownie dip or brownie, yeah, brownie drip. Uh, if you have pigmented lips like I do, I have pigmented lips. I don't know if you can tell. But these actually look amazing. These look like your real, like your real lips, but like better in a way. So it gives you like that nudie look without it looking like ashy nude, if that makes sense. <laughs> so it doesn't get ashy. It doesn't look ashy nude. Yeah, I love these. Ooh, everything's falling. So that is everything in the purse. The purse is empty. Absolutely empty. I didn't even show you what was inside the um antibac what the antibacterial soap was. It's in cactus blossom. I don't know if my camera is gonna Can you guys see that? I ordered a like a five or six pack of these. It smells good, but I would never do that again because I get tired of the smell. So that's what I keep in that um, thing. So both of you can get at Bath and Body Works. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of, it was a mess in a bit. But yeah, that's everything I keep in my purse. This purse compared to my last purse is a tad bit smaller because i like to keep a lot of stuff but i noticed that this purse actually like limits what i can bring so realistically if i had to bring like a tablet I, it won't work laptop won't work so a lot of things just won't work <laughs> but for what i do have i i do have a lot like the basics to get me through my day i feel like but that's a basically it because it's at its max capacity. Like, as you can see, it's not giving that much room. But it's cute. Yeah. So, yeah. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. <laughs>